All right, hello there beauties, your girl Eunice Marie here, and I know I've been gone for like, what, two weeks? I know, it's been, the holidays were here, and the new year was here, and I took a little bit of a break from YouTube, but I am back, and I wanna say Merry Christmas and Happy, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and um, Happy New Year to you guys as well. So today's topic is going to be about how to apply false lashes and remove false lashes. Um, you guys may not, see me wear lashes a lot in my videos. I don't wear false lashes a lot. It's here and there that I do wear them. But when I do wear them, I do have certain tips and techniques that I use that are really helpful. So I'm gonna go ahead and share with you guys my tips and techniques on how to apply false lashes as well as removing them. So if you wanna see how to do that. I'm gonna share with you guys what you're gonna need. You're gonna need some eyelashes of your choice. And the one I'm going to be using are the 66 Red Cherry Lashes. And there's another pair that I have that is the number 12. They're more of a wispy um, type of lash. And then you're going to need a glue adhesive for it. Now, I got the wrong lash adhesive. I got the one for individuals, but you wanna get the one for strips, but Lash glue is lash glue, so we're going to use that one. <laughs> but um, you want to make sure you get the um, regular one for the strip lashes. And this is what that glue looks like. And then you're going to need a tweezers. Tweezers are going to help you to handle the lash, um, push the lash down. It's just all about control, so that's going to be your tool to help you. And scissors, of course, to size them. Now, taking my lashes in number 66, I'm going to take them and peel them off of the actual little container. Very um, easy and slowly because you can damage the lash if you're too rough with it. All right, so how you're gonna know which lash is the left and which lash is the right is by the inner corners. The shorter hair goes into the corner so you'll know which which um, lash goes which, with which eye, okay? Now, the problem that I had with this batch of eyelashes that I've gotten is that they were a tad bit too short and you probably see me here like, yo, what's going on? They were a tad bit too short so I didn't have to cut them like I usually would. So I'm just gonna take the lash, um, and actually I'm gonna take the lash glue, and I'm gonna pour it onto the back of the clear lid, and then I'm gonna take my lash and I'm going to run it through the glue, making sure to pay special attention to the ends of the lashes because if you don't put enough glue on the ends of the lashes, um, they can come up and it's not cute walking around with your eyelashes with the ends blowing in the wind, okay? It's not cute. So you wanna make sure to especially focus on those ends. And then you're gonna wait for it to get tacky. And while I wait for it to get tacky, I bend it like this to kinda um, fit my eye a little bit easier, you know? So then once it's tacky and it's ready to go, you're gonna go ahead and apply your lash now. Practice, practice, practice. Like I always say with everything else, you wanna make sure to kind of practice um, how to apply the lash because it takes a while to kind of figure out, you know, measure it out right and all of that. But once you got that down, trust me, putting on lashes will be as easy as one, two, three, literally. Now this is where your handy dandy tweezers come in. You just take the back part of it and you start to push down the lash, making sure that your ends especially are tacked down and you place the lash closest to the eye, to the eyelash, um, the eyelash as possible so that it looks, you know, natural. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to do the same exact thing to my other eye. Okay, so now here is a, a really good example of if you don't apply enough um, lash glue to the corner. And as you can see, I'm kind of struggling because I didn't apply enough glue to the corner so it's not sticking down. And um, so I ended up having to take it off and then re 
put some more glue or you can use like a q-tip and apply some glue into that inner corner and press it down that's another way you can do it but you want to make sure that if your ends are not tied down you want to make tied down if your ends are not this is not hair units <laughs> if your ends are not glued down your corners you want to make sure to go back and make sure everything is glued down and use your um your tweezers to help you Now to hide the band of the lashes or to make it look a little bit more on the natural side, I take my liquid liner by L'Oreal and I make a cat eye. So I just use the liquid liner to cover up the band to make it look um, a little bit more natural or blend more into your eye and look a little bit more like, you know, your lashes. And then I take a little bit of my mascara as well and I blend my natural lashes into the false lashes. You can also use a lash curler to blend your lashes into um, the, the false lashes if your lashes are more on the straighter side. But my lashes curl up a tad bit, so I don't I don't use the um, a lash curler, but that is another option as well. And last but not least, whatever you do, always wear it with confidence. Wearing false lashes, um, we get some tips that I kind of, I don't know, just some tips that will help you guys wear false lashes. Now, you just want to make sure that you adhere them right, because if you don't put them on right, they're not going to look right. The corners, you want to make sure that they are um, push down and glue down very nice and neatly and you want to make sure that you blend your regular lashes with the actual eyelash um, but with that being said that's pretty much it when it comes to wearing eyelashes um, another thing is that I've never been a big fan of like the big clown eyelashes I don't know what's going on with that trend but nowadays there's like this trend where they have like the big false lashes and they just look so unnatural i like to lean more towards natural looking eyelashes you know except for i guess when one is on the runway or whatnot but i mean i guess on an everyday basis i mean you really don't need to wear the big old clown lashes i i just it always has never been a, a favorite trend of mine but i guess to each his own but yeah, with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully that was helpful for you guys out there who are just beginning and want to wear lashes. Um, so yeah, make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I will talk to you guys in a later video. Now, I totally forgot to film taking off the eyelashes, but it's really, really simple. You can use any oil of your choice, like coconut oil, olive oil, almond oil, jojoba oil. And what you're going to do is just take that massage it into the lashes and once it's loose you peel it right off and that's it so yeah never just rip your lashes off that is a big no-no thanks for watching make sure to click the link to subscribe and stay up on my latest beauty videos makeups tips and tricks and i will see you guys in a later video bye